One thing that I've learned from being in quarantine is that people, this is like being in jail is what it is. It's mostly because I've been wearing the same clothes for 10 days and everyone in here is gay. D- does that make me gay? Alrighty, alrighty, it is Zian Noob Noob, and we're here to give you a little bit of a, I guess it's breaking news, sort of, breaking news. Is it? Ellen is canceled. She's canceled herself, or she's probably not making any more money anymore. Ellen DeGeneres? Ellen DeGeneres. like The, the fish most from Nemo. Correct. Dory. Dory. Mm-hmm. She is Dory. Dory so, was not gay, though. How do you know? That's fair. Yes, that's fair. Ellen's a pioneer, and she's been getting herself in tons of trouble, getting canceled for them jokes, gay jokes. No, the joke I just told was an Ellen joke. She told that. Joke yeah, and almost got. Well, she got in big trouble. I don't for that know joke why she too. got in big trouble because she's gay. It's a good joke, and it is a good joke. <laughs> and she lives with other gays. Like, oh, yeah. it's, it's a good thing, right? Well, let's go to the article and see if we can learn a little bit more about what's going on here. Looks like Ellen's talk show is going to end, and she claims. That she needs something new to challenge me. Maybe a man. (laughs) She's going to run to men's. She is going to round up as many men as she can. (laughs) Ravage them. I mean, I I don't think that that's the reason why she's canceling the show. You know, maybe it's because she's getting no ratings and that the... uh, People hate her now. Yeah, people hate her now because they're claiming she's not as nice as she claims to be. I have heard multiple stories of Ellen is just an asshole. But <laughs> Can you confirm any of those? I don't know, but I mean, she seems sweet as the fish in Dory. Again, that's the only thing I know her from. Super excited about that fish, huh? Yeah. Just it's a good love, movie. Love them fish. Really heart-wrenching. Which movie? Both? Finding oh. Dory was a little little more heart-wrenching than Nemo. Really? Why? I think because of the, the when she was a little fishy and she lost her parents and she couldn't remember them or something. Oh, okay. That's she had the Alzheimer's. Thing. She, she has something like Michael J. Fox. He does that was Parkinson's. Mm-hmm. Muhammad Ali. Full of also not Alzheimer's. Also Parkinson's. <laughs> Shit. So the show is on its nineteenth season, and they're like, "Why didn't you go to 20? Well, because no one will pay her to keep going. Because apparently oh, she's got like three thousand staff members or something. Dear ridiculous. Lord, all in her house. All of those people are going. All very they're gay. All out of all out of work. Uh, Her quote is, when you're a creative person, you constantly need to be challenged. And as great as this show is, and as fun as it is, it's just not a challenge to me anymore. She hasn't even announced it yet. She she informed her staff on the 11th, May 11th, 2021. And it looks like she's going to tell Oprah on the 13th. No, she's the... No, what? Yeah, it says she's going to have a thing with Oprah. She's going oh, yeah. to her uh, Oprah yeah. Winfrey to discuss news on Oprah on, Winfrey is going to take back over her her daytime slot. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. What's just gonna going to give on. out fucking cars to everybody. <laughs> I don't know. Start scissoring princes that she, she has a comedian brother. Apparently, he said keep going. Um, to, <laughs> she has what is it? Uh, she's twenty four hundred celebrity interviews. I don't know. I've never watched one episode. I know she it. always comes out dancing. That's about as far as it gets. Uh, that's yeah. My mom watched it once, and I was home, and I was like, "I'm gonna go in the basement now. <laughs> I'm gonna go hide in the basement. Yeah, I'm gonna go I'm back scared. in the closet because this doesn't make me want to be out." <laughs> I don't know. She made. They're trying to make it nice here because this is the Hollywood Reporter that we're going off of. They're saying, uh, you know, it was a midday jolt of joy, and uh, with dancing, games, and giveaway, seventy million dollars in charitable donations, all of them being thrown away. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Oh my god, an iconic, uh, oh my gosh, hold on. Uh, it's, they say it's an uh, iconic American TV program, Trailblazer, blah, 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 blah. But 84 million in annual income. <laughs> Holy, how do you walk away from that? Although 19 years times 84 million is. I'm pretty sure she wasn't making 84 million 19 years ago. Fairly certain. She'd be a billionaire. You don't think she's pretty darn close? I don't know. Ooh. She got enough money to disappear onto an island and never I mean she has enough money to turn her house into an a island gay prison or island an actual, an actual yeah. prison a gay prison island for her oh my god why is yeah. it gonna be gay well, cause she says everyone oh, in the her geez. house is gay and she like came out and said that she was sorry for being 
Whatever. day. I don't like. No, I don't understand like why. Apologize for that. There was like a bunch of abuse or something going on. See, we don't know anything. See, that's worse. Uh, she is the woman who says, uh, "Yep, I'm gay." In the 1997 time cover story oh that's right she wasn't gay the entire time she was famous right she didn't come out until no, like midway through out. yeah something like that i don't know how would i how am i supposed to i don't that? maybe she's your idol who knows uh she she's earned 64 daytime emmys that's 63 more than that we know about daytime emmys are tight <laughs> they're so tight so what we're tight saying like a tiger. So she has earned more emmys than anyone working at the oprah network is what we're saying Probably, I don't god. know. Oh my god, so Have many you reasons for that. I don't know. I, uh, wh- uh, do I care? Do I care? No, no. Really. I just thought it was amusing. Are they going to replace her with another famous person? I don't know. We're, it's still too hurtful. It's too too fresh. Too soon. Too soon. Too soon. I just wanted to do a picture of an anaconda from anaconda of an anaconda eating a Ellen snake, because yes. the no, she's not eating the snake. The snake is eating her. Or is it an Ouroboros? Is wokeness. Oh, okay. See that? Get woke. Is she bro- super woke though? No, she's really not. I think like she got in trouble for being friends with George Bush or something. Yeah, like, she did. And then she's like, she's, I can be friends with anyone. Yeah, I don't know. She. I guess it's like the whole like maybe there's hypocrisy because they were saying it's a toxic workplace. As I scan through this article, I should have read it before we did this episode. That would have But helped. I did not. Because but is Ellen I don't worth care. a read? No. No. Clearly not, because she's being canceled. If there was years. an internal investigation, and then they fired some people's. I just I wanted to see the part where it says like how many people will lose their jobs because of this. A lot. <laughs> so you're gonna sit down with Oprah. So many more unemployed people's. Wow. Getting those bonus monies. I guess this is an actual interview because it says like you're gonna sit down with Oprah, who's been in your shoes, and she's like, first of all, she wears like Louis Vuitton heels. She's not been in my shoes because mine are more comfortable. Oh, oh, oh. oh boy. Wow, this is an actual writ- written interview. No wonder it's so positive. Oh well. So. That's kind of the deal. I gotta delete it off my DVR now. <laughs> you have a lot of episodes. Sad to, day. You have a lot of episodes. Whole to catch lot up of Ellen. On. So much Ellen. Well, anyway, yeah. I guess that that's all we we just wanted to break some news for once. That wasn't it was negative, but not so negative. It wasn't somebody dying this time? That no. was my point. Last time oh, we broke news. Poor Kobe. We usually break dying people news. Poor Kobe. I mean, he he was a raper, but he did. Oh my God, he was. He did he was a the great. greatest basketball player, and do not no do not besmirch the great name of Kobe Lee Bryant. He did it. Kobe Janice Bryant. Kobe. Kobe Beef Ellen Bryant. Bryant. That's it. Kobe Beef Bryant. I do like Kobe Beef. So uh, make sure if you, if maybe today is the day we earn that subscription from you, give us a little subscribe thing. It's it's there somewhere. And, and maybe a thumbs up. We like those. And thumbs if we up. get 10 subscribers from this video, you can have your own version of Kobe Beef. <laughs> He'll we'll dig up his grave too. and serve it to you fresh. Oh my gosh. Oh, that that was that too much? Too soon. Too much. Anyway, uh, please like us. On to the next one. Or you. Thank you.